Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Lisa Cotter and today we're going through my planned colouring pages for March 2023. So let's get started. So the first one will be um, four more pages in Johanna Basford's colouring planner. So for those that have never watched my channel before, I got this for Christmas. And so every week I've been doing one of the pages. And so I'll be doing another four in this. And I am behind on the February, March one, but I've been so busy. So this one I'll be doing. So it might be five pages. This one, Yep, there is another one there. This one here. And this one. And if I get the time, I will do this one as well. And try and catch up. So they will probably be with all Derwent pencil lines. So what I do um, is every week, I'm going through my pencils alphabetically and using like for this week here, for last week's, it was Derwent Artist Pencils. So the next one here, this will be the Derwent Studio Pencils, this page here, which have not been used for so many years. They've been sitting in a box for 10 years or more. <laughs> so that'll be interesting. So that will be that for those four pages there. And the next four will actually be um, Buddy Colours with four lovely ladies. So let's get started on them. So this will be the Kingdom of Curious Creatures, a fairy tale adventure book by Konako Agasa. Now this is with Hape. She is from the Colourfully Optimistics Discord group. And we have been doing for the last two months, um, page 23 by the 23rd. So, um, I'll be actually doing this one with Happy, Happy, sorry. <laughs> and it'll be this page here, which this is such a pretty page and I haven't colored in this book yet. So I'm looking forward to actually getting this one done. That'll be interesting. And um, that'll be a lot of fun. And it'll be getting a page done in this book. So thank you, Happy. That'll be a lot of fun. And then the next one is with Zoo, again from the Colourfully Optimistics Discord group. Um, this is Travels Through Asia by Rita Berman, or I think that's what it's called. And we will be doing this page here. Again, um, it'll be page 23 by the 23rd. So it'll be this page here. And that's cute and it looks simple enough. So that'll be a lot of fun. And I haven't coloured in this book either. So that'll be really good. I'll be able to get a page done in there. The next one is a buddy colour with Amanda Colours. Now Amanda is a fellow Aussie and she has a YouTube channel. So I will put that in the link in the description below. Um, and she just hit 1K subscribers, so congratulations, Amanda. And so go check her page out. She's a lovely lady. And we're going to be doing this page here. And this will be so fun to do. And I definitely will be matching these two together. So I've only got one done in this book, so this would be really good to get into this one as well. So thank you so much, Amanda, for asking me. I can't wait to get started on that page as well. Now, my last buddy color will be from a viewer from my channel. Um, this is Luna by Maria Troll, and I was asked by a bubble of coloring if I would do a buddy color with her. And she let me decide out of four pages and the one we're going to do, I'll put that over there, is this page here. And 
as I said in if you haven't seen my completed coloring pages I really love this book so I'm really excited to get this started this would be lovely so thank you so much bubbler coloring um, bubbler coloring also has a YouTube channel so I will put a link to her channel as well so thank you so much this will be a lot of fun to get this started so they will be my buddy colors and these are some other books I hope to color in, color in. If I get them done, it'll be good. If I don't, too bad. They'll have to go to the next month. Um, I really want to do a page in A Frog's Tale by RJ Hampson. This is his latest book. Um, Mr. Froggerty Coloring Book. And it's a bit of a romance book I've heard, but it looks so cute. He really does well. Look at them all. <laughs> um, I'm not sure which page I want to do first. Um, I was watching, I think it's Wendy Colors, is that? Um, and she'd done this page and it looks so amazing. And it was like, oh, I'd love to do that. But I was looking at this page here. Um, I thought that was really cute and it's just hit autumn here in Australia so I thought I could do this some nice warm autumn colors or spring I don't know but this page is the one I thought I would actually do so that is RJ Hampson's A Frog's Tale and that is his latest book the next one is a new book as well this is Enchanted Earth by, I'm not even going to say it, and I say this with the my favourite colouring book, Circle of Life, <laughs> but I'm not going to say it. So this is her latest book, and it is beautiful. I really love all the images, and of course, I would love to do this page, but I've seen so many videos, and everyone's doing that page. So I'm going to pick a different page. Um, but it is such a beautiful book and these are single sided. So I was thinking of maybe doing that page there, the first page, but these are single sided, but the paper is a little bit thinner. So I'm not sure um, how I'll approach this one, but this looks beautiful with all the butterflies and the birds and the little scene here but yes yeah, so I'm thinking of doing that page there and I can tell you now this book is probably going to be another favorite of mine I love the circle of life book it's my one of my favorites so this one definitely will be as well so that is enchanted earth um, definitely a very nice book and single-sided and then the other ones are if I get to them and if I don't, you know. Um, but I definitely, I'd like to do another page in Enchanted Forest. I've had this book for nearly two years now and I've only done one page. So I'd really like to get a page done. This is by Johanna Basford. This is one of the first colouring books I purchased when I first started colouring. So I'd like to do something in here. Um, I have got the mini one now, so this is the one I'd actually done, but I would like to do another page. I do have the backgrounds done here, but um, and I could do that with autumn, but I don't know. I'm thinking of doing something different in here. But this is such a lovely book by Johanna, Johanna Basford. And as I said, I do have the mini one and I have the artist edition as well. So I'd like to do one of them. And then for our colour along, I thought we'd do a page in Rooms of Wonder. Now I'm just going to pause the video. I've got a cough. Sorry about that. So yes, for our colour along, I would love to do um, a page in Rooms of Wonder. So this is by Johanna Basford and I have only done one page in here and this I'm actually using Artex colour pencils, but I'm willing to use other colour pencils in here. Um, but I really do like how the Artex colour pencils work on this paper. 
So I would love to do another page in here and do it as a colour along. So if you'd like that, just let me know in the description below. I was thinking maybe we could do something, some of these, um, and then maybe next month hit this page here. I know there's a lot of colour alongs for Johanna Basford's Rooms of Wonder, but um, I know a lot of people like this book and it's such a lovely book and until her new book comes out um which is small victories which i think is going to be a small size book so it won't be as big as and as this one but it will be sort of like how the little items here from what i could see her sketching she had little dinosaurs and different things so it'll be a lot of fun i think um It'll be great for colour alongs that book too. So this is Rooms of Wonder by Johanna Basford. So I'd like to do a colour along in there. Now, the next two would be Hannah Lynn's Enchanted Faces or the Fierce and Fancy Fantasy Faces Pocket Size Colouring Books. So these are both pocket size. Now, last month we did the Artex Pale Skin Tone Tutorial which I did it as a time lapse on this page here. And I thought we could do another page doing tan skin. Um, I'd like to do it in this book here, but if you'd like me to start this one, do let me know. I'm happy to do either. So I'd like it to sort of match in with what I'm doing. So you can have a different view and being able to see what I'm doing and um, have my swatch chart and everything so it'll be a complete page it won't be just the skin tone and um, I'd like to do that so that's two color alongs there now another page I would love to get into this is Christine Karen's new book this is the artist edition book now this was done by an Australian publisher and I purchased this straight from the publisher um, last month. And this book is just beautiful. Um, as with anything to do with Christine Karen, her images are just stunning. Now these are all grayscale. Um, it's just a, such a lovely book and the paper is really nice as well. And I can't wait to get into these. So it would be a lovely something in this book would be nice to do this month um, I, if you want me to videotape myself coloring I can do that um, so that's definitely a book I'd like to get into now for Australian viewers a friend of mine contacted me she got a copy from Big W for $18 now, from the publisher, this cost $26, but Big W had them out for $18. Now, I haven't been near a Big W to see myself, um, but that's a real bargain if you can get it for $18, because this is such a beautiful book, and this is the artist edition. Um, really lovely paper. So definitely, if you're an Australian, well worth trying to get that one she does amazing artwork and then the last one I'd like to do is the a page in the mythographic enchanted castles now I never got it this is the F Fabiana and, and Tassano I didn't get to this one last month I really wanted to but I just ran out of time and um, I was burnt out after that other page I'd done so I'd like to do um, something in here it would be really nice to get a page done because I really love the luck look at the detail just stunning and these do have hidden objects but it doesn't really bother, bother me like here's a water bottle um, doesn't bother me and there's a cupcake I just noticed there so definitely something I'd like to do and these are single sided and the paper if you can hear that is really thick and then 
I have purchased these in Fort of my channel. So these are the miniature Johanna Basfords, um, Enchanted Forest and the Sacred Garden. Now these were out really cheap. So um, I got these for the channel because I thought these would be perfect for quick little colour alongs where people can um, colour and especially if they have the miniature. Um, now the images are very miniature as well. Still detailed. They're still the main book, but just in small size. So I wouldn't mind actually doing a colour along um, either this month or next in one of these miniature books because it wouldn't take as long because they are smaller and it's just something relaxed we can do. So those two there. And this is the Secret Garden one. Again, these are her very first books. I think this was one of her first books. So as you can see, there's a lot of um, space. So not as much to colour, but I can at least show how I do leaves and flower petals and things like that. So um, these are really good. So they only miniature small like same about the same size of your hand so that would be fantastic so if you've gotten to the end of the video thank you so much for watching i hoped you enjoyed um watching all the coloring pages i'd like to do of course i will not get half of them done properly um i'll be happy if i get done my diary and the buddy colors and um i hope you all have a wonderful week uh, month of coloring now if you'd like anyone would like to do a buddy color with me just let me know i'm happy to do buddy colors um, i'd love to do them they're fun it's better coloring with other people so you can contact me via email which is um here on my youtube channel you can also contact me on instagram and i'm on facebook as well so just let me know i'm happy to do buddy colors i find them fun so thank you for watching if you liked my video press like and subscribe and press the bell button to be notified um, when i do a new video so take care have a lovely day and happy coloring